gentlemen, uh, let me introduce uh, myself. Uh, my name is Bernard Levo. I'm coming from France. I used to be uh, the general manager of Multivac uh, in France, and uh, since uh, four years now, I'm in charge of uh, developing uh, the packaging uh, solution for uh, the fish and seafood business worldwide. So my purpose today is to uh, present you uh, some uh, innovation and trends uh, in the fish uh, and seafood market uh, at today. So first, uh, just a small presentation about who is Multivac. Uh, Multivac is a world leader uh, in machinery uh, for packaging uh, food product and medical product with uh, vacuum packaging and uh, modified atmosphere and we have a whole range of machines from the smallest one called chamber machine to the roll stock and thermoforming machine uh, going through the tray sealer so we we have all the solutions in that way we are a german company and we are all worldwide implemented so probably uh, near of your door you have somebody from Multivac who can uh, help you or assist you in the definition of the packaging of your product. So, let's come now to uh, the main points that we will speak uh, today. The so first, uh, we will speak about the market trend. Uh, we will also make a, a, a short flight about uh, shelf life and uh, we will speak about marketing through packaging and we will see one or two examples of uh, process and technology innovation that could be interesting for your product in the future. So, first about market trend. What's happened in the market actually? First of all, uh, one thing, uh, development of supermarket store. Uh, everywhere in the world you have more and more supermarkets uh, answering to a, a real demand of the consumer and of course uh, in this supermarket, uh, the fish department, uh, which is included, uh, is letting more and more place uh, to uh, some uh, uh, style and uh, pre-packed product. Uh, inside of this supermarket, the, the space for the traditional fish stall is completely reduced now. And uh, for the reason for that is that there is many advantages for the pack. Uh, pack products uh, like Chef Life or Cruise, but also hygiene, uh, work cost reduction for the, the retailer, uh, an easier storage, uh, less uh, loss of produce, and a limitation of the bacteriological risk, which is one of the uh, most important things that the distributor take in consideration. And uh, for this reason, all these points are taken in consideration to uh, manage uh, in each supermarket more and more space to the uh, pre-packed uh, shell. Second, second trend which uh, we have to play with that uh, in this last, uh, let's say, 20 years, uh, consumers' habit evolution are, uh, are very, very high. Uh, more and more working women, uh, single people, and uh, deconsecrating of the family meal time because of the activity of each. Uh, we have no more time to eat together outside perhaps of Saturday or Sunday in some family, but uh, generally speaking, uh, everybody eat when he can or when he come back from school or from the gymnastic or uh, that, but that's a real fact worldwide. So. And that's uh, completely changed the behavior of the people. You come to the fridge, you need something convenient, you open the door and you take the, 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 the ready meal you want or you take the, the product you want. And generally, they are packed. Um, so the consumer demand more and more produce which are ready, uh, ready product, ready to use, ready to cook, ready to heat or to eat, uh, fast to prepare, uh, and also easy to store. That's very important. Another trend is also snacking. You will see in my picture after that we have a lot of snacking today. Why? Because people are more and more snacking, eating when they have time or when they are free. Uh, some people say it's not healthy, but that's, that's a real trend of the market. We are snacking more and more, and packaging is taking this consideration. And uh, one thing is also shows sure that the people have no more time, but also no more wish. Uh, to uh, shop every day to, to, to buy some product and to prepare cooking. Uh, they make shopping once a week 
And for this reason, uh, they demand a longer shelf life. So they demand some packaging and they demand vacuum and MAP packaging. And packaging avoid a lot of disadvantage bonded to the fish product, which are, of course, smell, preparation, cleaning, uh, sticky aspect of the product, the color also, and contact uh, for short, short shelf life. All these points, you can uh, manage it and uh, have a better result with packaging. That's one of the reasons why you have so uh, beautiful packaging in, in here like tuna steak with MAP or uh, this uh, very nice uh, uh, shell uh, which is uh, from Spain and which is under vacuum. Third point of the trend, that's the competition in the market uh, and the necessity of uh, differentiation. Because packaging brings a high possibility to give more attractivity for your product. Uh, it's also, also allow you to market it. Uh, packaging supports the brand and your image, as we said before. And the competition worldwide in fish business is more and more tight. Margins are tighter and produce needs some way to differentiate if you want to be the leader or if you want to make a significant added value. You have to be different. And packaging is a real answer to this concern. Let me show you an example and we will come back after when we will speak about marketing in this aspect. But here in a market like shrimp where you have a very, very big sophistication of the demand because you are uh, uh, on the market without a stagnation, you can see the different way of pack that you can have and of course which is the one you are going to buy or which is the one you, which attracts you first. And last but not least, of course, uh, if hygiene, traceability, sustainability are more and more points that we have to play with. The alimentary, alimentary risk is one of the uh, most uh, first preoccupation worldwide to the consumer when you make a, an inquiry or a demand, the answer, security, LC product. Uh, that's bind with some problems like BSC or like foot and mood disease, bird flu, which give a, 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 an increasing demand of the people from a, a quality product and of course a, a secure product. People want to eat safe and one of the big advantage of fish that's at today, outside some small problem in salmon or in, in farming, uh, the, the reputation and the image of the, of the fish uh, in the consumer uh, mantle is, is, is very high as a LC product. So that's very important to keep that. The packaging, of course, bring a big contribution to hygiene, but it also allow by, by labeling and, and by uh, adding some information to make a, a, a good traceability, answering in that way also to the demand of the consumer. And uh, one thing is also very important that consumers are more and more aware about what happened in the sea and uh, on the, the uh, disparation of the resource. And uh, uh, they want uh, to follow the newspaper, they want to follow the campaign from the, some distributor. Uh, and uh, they want to uh, be uh, clean with the planet and to respect the environment, but also the animals, the resource. And in that way, packaging has a place because we reduce the loss on the product and uh, we uh, keep a better chef life. So by that way, we are, we are playing uh, for one part in this conservation and this sale of the raw product. So, there is an unavoidable trend that we have to consider and to accept that this beautiful uh, eye style, which was very attractive inside of the supermarket uh, that you find in Fishmonger, uh, is just now more and more there to attract the people and to, to, to just remember that, that the fish area, but in fact, you have more and more uh, products which are uh, presented on shelf and uh, packed.